so I understand you and the rest of the grocery store workers are in a position to strike. Yes, our contract expired months ago and we were fed up so we were hitting the streets to get what we deserve. What exactly is it that you think you deserve? More pay, a better pension program, improved health care, and job security. I'm sorry, you were a checker at the grocery store aren't you? I would have thought that that was a minimum wage type position reserved for part-time workers and the handicapped. That is not the case. Being a checker is very challenging work and we should be paid more to do it. The grocery store business is booming and our employer made a lot of profit and we want some of that profit. That's kind of the purpose of being in business, to make a profit. If you just give it all away you won't stay in business very long, believe it or not. I've been to the grocery store a number of times in my life and checking groceries does not seem to be much of a challenge. First you might have to ask paper or plastic and then you drag a barcode across a scanner, stick it in a bag and move on to the next item until the customer's card is empty. The computer then tells you how much to charge and the customer does all of the work to make the payment. There's a lot more to it than that that goes on behind the scenes. Oh really? Like what? Sometimes the barcode doesn't capture and we have to manually enter the item. Other times a piece of fruit might be missing the sticker that tells us what to enter so we have to look it up. Wow. That does sound like a real challenge. I know. How long would it take someone to learn to be a checker? At least an entire day. That kind of confirms my thinking that you deserve nothing more than minimum wage. As I recently told a college support worker that some strike, if someone can be trained to do your job in a day, it does not require anything more than minimum wage. You could find someone quite easily that would gladly take your job for minimum wage without any benefits. You don't bring any special talents to the table and that's what determines the actual value of an employee and what they should be paid. Every one of you could be replaced tomorrow by people that would gladly do your job for less. Well we work at these grocery stores now so they have to pay us more since we are unionized and we are contracted. Why don't you just quit and go find another job? Are you crazy? The unemployment rate in California is 11%. As John and Ken have said on their radio show, when you include the people that have stopped looking for work and those that chook jobs that pay them much less than they used to get the actual rate is more like 17%. When you hear yourself say that does it not ring any bells or start to make sense why you don't deserve more than you are getting? No. Jesus. Speaking to union workers is just a waste of time. You are all blind and haven't a clue. Just get your ass back to work and be thankful that you have a job without having any real qualifications.